with only one light on in the Northern Burlington gym hanging above the wrestling mat, it is time for the Northern Burlington Greyhounds to take on the Burlington Township Falcons. After three weight classes of individuals from both teams winning their match, the Falcons took a 9-6 lead going into the fourth weight class. I know how improved they are. You know, I've watched a lot of those kids grow up for the last three years. Um, you know, I know that, that they have a nice senior class and, and they were looking forward for this year, to this year for a long time. I knew what we have and I know what they have, so I kind of knew that it was going to be going back and forth like that. Um, there were some matches that I didn't think we would give up a pin in, but, you know, that's, that's wrestling. The final lead change of the meet came as Steven Truex pinned Chris Williams at 195 pounds to take a 12-9 lead. Not really. I mean, this season I've, I've been coming out with a bit of a, a more of a fire. I believe in myself more than I did last year. So, I mean, no matter who I'm wrestling, I just come out with that fire because I know I can get my team pumped up. So I just come out, do what I got to do. And after that, all momentum was in Northern Burlington's favor as they won the next five straight matches, including a pin by Chris Brady and Bill Nolan and a 5-4 decision as sophomore Travis Koltonicki defeated Craig Cook. Yeah, well, the match, the match is close, so you know you just got to wrestle and just get the take down and get the points you need. But I just prepared for the match, meet some four, got ready for it, just wrestled. You know, it, it, I think it kind of took the wind out of them a little bit. Um, you know, obviously, he's, he's one of their better kids, and, uh, you know, Trav's a hard worker, man. He's a little bulldog. I mean, it's tough to go against him for six minutes because he's not going to stop. The Northern Burlington Greyhounds defeated the Burlington Township Falcons in 10 of their 14 matches to come away with the win. It's great, you know, we're, we're working our way towards our 8th league title, so any, anything we can do, you know, we got to keep that legacy going. I, we knew that they're, you know, a, a very good program and that uh, we would kind of have our hands full going into the match. I think a lot of our guys wrestled very well. I just think our young kids wrestled their tails off. You know, our, our, our sophomores really came through big, or I thought our seniors did well. Uh, you know, all the way through the lineup. You know, we're tough. We're tough. I, I think we're we're good where we are, and uh, we just got to keep focus on getting better. For more high school wrestling coverage, follow us all winter on Facebook and Twitter at BCT Game On hashtag BCT Sports. Reporting from Northern Burlington High School, I'm Renee Washington.